far beyond the familiar boundaries of our solar system, in the silent emptiness of interstellar space, Voyager 1 continues its lonely journey. Launched by NASA in 1977, it was never intended to travel this far, yet it has defied all expectations. This spacecraft, no larger than a small car, has now traveled more than 15 billion miles from Earth, pushing through regions where the sun's influence weakens and the vast, uncharted realm of deep space begins. Decades after leaving our planet, it still sends faint signals back to Earth, whispering secrets about the cosmos. It is a testament to human curiosity and ingenuity, but also a reminder of how small we are compared to the vastness surrounding us. Voyager 1's mission began during an era when humanity was still taking its first steps toward understanding the outer planets. It was part of a twin mission with Voyager 2, designed to take advantage of a rare planetary alignment that allowed both spacecraft to visit Jupiter and Saturn using gravity assists. What was originally meant to be a four-year mission became something far more significant. Voyager 1 not only captured the first detailed images of Jupiter's turbulent atmosphere and Saturn's mysterious rings, but also provided groundbreaking data about their moons, magnetospheres, and atmospheric compositions. Each flyby expanded our understanding of the solar system, revealing worlds more diverse and dynamic than scientists had ever imagined. After its planetary encounters, Voyager 1 continued outward, eventually crossing the heliopause in 2012. This invisible boundary marks the point where the solar wind from our sun is no longer strong enough to push back the interstellar medium, the thin soup of gas, dust, and charged particles that fills the space between stars. Crossing into this realm was historic, for the first time, a human-made object had entered interstellar space. The data it sent back from this region was unlike anything ever recorded. It revealed a dramatic shift in particle density and magnetic field patterns, confirming that the spacecraft had left the sun's protective bubble. Scientists realized they were getting a direct taste of what the universe is like beyond our solar neighborhood. Recently, Voyager 1 became the focus of renewed excitement when Bill Nye, a well-known science communicator, shared news that the spacecraft had detected around 300 massive objects in space. The announcement sparked intense speculation among scientists and the public alike. Were these objects rogue planets, drifting aimlessly through the galaxy after being ejected from their home systems? Could they be brown dwarfs, failed stars that never ignited? Or perhaps they were something stranger, remnants of ancient celestial collisions, or even entirely new classes of cosmic phenomena we have yet to name. Without closer inspection, their true nature remains a mystery, but the mere detection of such objects underscores how little we truly know about the interstellar environment. Voyager 1's ability to make such detections after nearly five decades in space is nothing short of remarkable. Its suite of instruments, though primitive by modern standards, continues to function with astonishing resilience. The spacecraft carries a cosmic ray detector, a magnetometer, and plasma sensors, all of which are still gathering valuable information. These instruments have helped scientists study how the sun's influence fades with distance and how the interstellar medium interacts with our solar system. Every bit of data Voyager 1 sends is precious, not only because it's our only direct sampling of interstellar space, but also because it represents a window into regions we may not explore again for generations. The journey has not been without challenges. Communication with Voyager 1 takes over 22 hours each way due to its immense distance from Earth. In recent years, engineers have had to deal with issues caused by the spacecraft's aging systems. One notable incident occurred when the spacecraft began sending garbled status reports, even though it was still operating normally. NASA discovered that the attitude and articulation control system had begun routing telemetry through a faulty computer that had been inactive for decades. The fix involved sending a command to switch back to a functioning system, a simple solution, but a reminder of how fragile the connection is. Every command must be planned carefully, and mistakes could mean permanent loss of contact. Despite these difficulties, Voyager 1 continues to serve as both a scientific instrument and a cultural symbol. On board is the Golden Record, a phonograph record containing sounds and images representing the diversity of life on Earth. From greetings in dozens of languages to music from different cultures, 
It was meant as a message to any intelligent life that might encounter the spacecraft. In a way, Voyager 1 is more than a probe. It is an ambassador, carrying a snapshot of our civilization into the cosmic unknown. The thought that somewhere, perhaps millions of years from now, another species could stumble upon it adds a poetic layer to its mission. The detection of the 300 mysterious objects also raises deeper questions about the nature of the galaxy. If such objects are so abundant that Voyager 1 encountered them in its relatively small patch of the Milky Way, what does that say about the rest of our galaxy? Could there be billions of them, silently roaming in the dark, invisible to our telescopes? Some scientists suggest that rogue planets may actually outnumber stars in the Milky Way drifting through interstellar space after gravitational interactions ejected them from their birth systems. Others wonder if such bodies could harbor subsurface oceans, warmed by internal heat, and perhaps even support life. If true, it would expand our understanding of where life might exist beyond Earth. Bill Nye's announcement, while exciting, also highlights how much remains to be confirmed. Voyager 1's instruments can detect variations in particle flows and magnetic fields, which may indicate the presence of large objects, but without visual confirmation, these detections remain open to interpretation. Nevertheless, even tentative discoveries are valuable. They point the way for future missions that could follow Voyager's path with more advanced technology, capable of directly imaging and studying these interstellar wanderers. Voyager 1's endurance is a testament to the skill of the engineers who built it and the dedication of the teams who continue to operate it. The spacecraft runs on power from a radioisotope thermoelectric generator, which uses the heat from decaying plutonium to produce electricity. However, this power source is gradually weakening. To keep Voyager 1 operating as long as possible, engineers have been systematically shutting down non-essential systems to conserve energy. It is expected that by the early 2030s, the spacecraft will no longer have enough power to run any instruments. When that day comes, Voyager 1 will fall silent, continuing its journey without sending any more messages to Earth. Even when the signal fades, the spacecraft will continue moving through the galaxy for billions of years. It will pass near other star systems, though the odds of it encountering a habitable world or intelligent life are slim. Still, its presence in interstellar space is symbolic. It represents humanity's first step beyond the protective shell of our sun's influence a step that may one day be followed by more ambitious voyages. As it travels farther from us, Voyager 1 becomes a reminder of how far human exploration has come in such a short time. In just a few centuries, we went from gazing at the planets through rudimentary telescopes to sending probes beyond the solar system. Each discovery made by Voyager 1 reinforces the fact that the universe is far stranger and more complex than we imagined. Whether it is the turbulent storms of Jupiter, the icy moons of Saturn, or the mysterious objects lurking between the stars, every finding challenges us to keep asking questions. The story of Voyager 1 is also a story about persistence. Against the odds, through decades of space travel, harsh radiation, and freezing temperatures, it continues to operate. It carries not only scientific instruments but also the hopes and dreams of those who build it and those who follow its journey. Every faint signal it sends back is a tiny thread connecting us to a place no human has ever been. In the grand scale of the universe, Voyager 1 is just a speck of metal hurtling through the dark, but it is our speck, and it is making history. Someday, another spacecraft will follow its trail, equipped with more advanced sensors and faster engines, capable of uncovering the secrets that Voyager 1 can only hint at. Until then, it remains our solitary outpost in the void, listening, measuring, and reminding us that there is still so much to learn. The vast expanse of interstellar space is not empty, it is full of mysteries waiting to be discovered. Voyager 1's journey proves that with patience, ingenuity, and the will to explore, even the smallest of messengers can carry humanity's story farther than we ever dreamed.